well, probably good afternoon by the time that you are watching this. I've got a lot of errands to run today, so I'm gonna take you along with me. First stop is uh, the Mamernak Public Library. Library. <laughs> Li library. Night lashes, silver night winters, and melted spring. These are a few of my- I have zero quarters. Everywhere to park in Westchester, you have to pay. What do I have? Like, three penny and a dime. Okay, so let's see how far that gets me. Look how old school this is. Actually, turn it. It is so much colder than I anticipated it being right now. It's snowing, but I'm going to the library. Official, an official library card. The librarian at the front desk explained to me how to use the library card for like 25 minutes. I smiled and I nodded and I said, thank you very much. And this, oh, this lady, she took me on a grand tour of the library and, and it was fine, but it was just like excessive. Um, but I ended up, they didn't have The Fault in Our Stars. I put it on hold. I really wanted to read Perks of a Wallflower too because Maggie's been talking about it and they also didn't have that. So I put them both on hold. <laughs> I got this just because I thought it looked so cute and I love London, I love England, I love anything British. And this one is called Mrs. Queen Takes the Train. I think it was written like right before the Queen's Diamond Jubilee. Ugh, there's nothing better than the smell of a library book. Am I right? So I'll let you know how that is. And then I got this, I don't know, um, but it's called You Suck, A Love Story by Christopher Moore. And I think it's about a vampire. The first sentence of like the synopsis is that being dead sucks. Making that being, make that being undead sucks. Literally. And then in quotes it says, you bitch, you killed me, you suck. I have no idea what it's about, but it looked funny. I would love some book suggestions, please. Cause I really need some good books. So if you have any suggestions, please comment in uh, the thingy. <laughs> Cleo needs to get her nails clipped. I've been trying for months to clip them, but she is so crazy. We need like five hands and I only have two. She has no idea that in about 30 seconds, I'm about to shove her in the cat carrier. After they groom an animal, they give her a cute little bandana. Can you see it? Stop. Can you see it? Okay, you're being rude. You're being rude. I also just stopped up off the bank and got $10 and quarters so I can freaking pay for all those parking meters now. And I'm gonna keep my car. I just literally spent $10 to buy quarters. Ridiculous. That's about it for me. Let me know if you like these kind of videos, like if you like these daily vlog-ish type things. I'm trying to figure out the best uh, kind of videos to make. So if you do like this or you'd like to see more daily vlogs, uh, give this video a really big thumbs up so I know. And um, subscribe. I'll see you later. Bye! The story of my Sir, your door is open. Sir, sir, the car you're driving, the door is open. The car, your door is open, sir.